Hello everyone. Welcome to today's lesson. We are going to start preparation for the IKSC. In this video, we are going to start the 30th International Kangaroo Science Contest 2020 for Benjamin level from class 5 and 6. Okay? Now, start. Question number one, a radio converts electrical energy to light energy, electrical energy to kinetic energy, light energy to sound energy, D, electrical energy to sound energy, E, mechanical energy to sound energy. Before going to find the answer, I just want to tell what is energy and how many types of energy are there you can see energy is defined as the ability to do work whenever you want to do something you must have energy it cannot be created nor destroyed but it can be changed from one form to another just like radio it can convert one form energy to another you can see here are nuclear, heat, light, potential, sound, electrical, chemical, kinetic energy. So we can convert one form of energy to another according to our need. So find the answer. Which one is correct? Electrical energy to sound energy because radio takes electrical energy and we use this radio to hear sound so obviously this energy can convert into sound energy the d is the best option now move on question number two first read i will read the question then i will show the information about that question then again read the question and find the answer this is the strategy okay now question number two a mushroom has the following characteristics. You can see this is mushroom and mushroom is not a plant, it's a fungus. A mushroom is a fleshy, spore-bearing, fruitening body of a fungus. It's actually it's a fungus. Typically above, produced above ground, on soil or on its food source. You have seen mucor on bread and on rotten oranges. That is green in color and we have done in class 6. As, what is a spore? A spore is a cell that contains fungi or other plants also produce spores. For example, moss and fern and bacteria as well. Spores are involved in reproduction. You can see in this picture, these are the spores and they play an important role in reproduction. It means fungus can be reproduced by spores. So now, go to the question again. A mushroom has the following characteristics. It reproduces by spores. Obviously, it is correct, but you have to read other options as well. It is a plant. No. It lives in aquatic environment. It may, may, maybe, but it is not the full, or you can say it's not a hundred percent correct. It has chlorophyll. No, it's not a plant. It doesn't have chlorophyll. It contains a single cell. Actually, there are different types of organisms. Some have only one cell. They are known as unicellular. And uh, multicellular organisms, they have more than one cell. You can see it's not a single cell. So it is incorrect. Understood? Okay. Now move on. Question number three. About the solar system, we get Ephraim. So before going to find the answer, just check this picture. This is the solar system. 
is his sun and the closest planet is Mercury. You can see this is Mercury. Then Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter and you can say Jupiter is the largest planet. Saturn, Uranus and Neptune. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7, 8. There are 8 planets and Jupiter is the largest planet. Mercury is the closest planet and Venus is also a planet. It's not a star. And you can say Neptune is the farthest planet. Now, read the options. The closest planet to the Sun is Neptune? No. Mars is known as the red planet? Yes. Saturn is the largest planet? No. You can see uh, this one is largest planet. Uranus is the farthest planet from the Sun? No. Neptune is the farthest planet. It contains seven planets and the star Venus is, Venus is not a star and it has eight planets. So B is the correct answer. Okay, got it? Now, question number four. Green algae and brown algae have the following common characters. Again, what are algae? Actually, Algae are photosynthetic organisms that possesses photosynthetic pigment such as chlorophyll. However, they lack true roots, stems and leaves. It means they are plants, they have chlorophyll, they make their own food, but they don't have true roots, stems and leaves. Some of them are unicellular, whereas others are multicellular. Some unicellular, I will tell the name just like Clematogonas and Euglena because we have to use these names in next paper as well. They are, may also form colonies. Most algae are aquatic, others are terrestrial. When you heard the word aquatic, it means aqua. Aqua means water. They are present in or on water. Others are terrestrial when you uh, use this word terrestrial means land or may be found on moist soil, trees and rocks. Now, green algae and brown algae have the following common character. They have root stems leaf? No, this is incorrect. They live in the terrestrial environment? No, they uh, consist of a single cell? No, this is the multicellular organisms. They feed through photosynthesis? They are the part of the bacteria kingdom? No, they are not the part of the bacteria kingdom. They are the plant. So they feed through O2 synthesis. This is the correct answer. Answer D. Now, which of the following optical instrument provide an upright virtual image that is equal to the object? Now I will show these optical objects. You can see microscope, mirror, magnifier, concave, mirror and curvaging lens. Now I will tell in detail. Concave mirror reflect light inward to fo one focal point. They are used to focus light. You can see the image is larger than its object. A double convex lens or converging lens focuses the diverging or blurred light rays from a distance object, refracting, bending the rays twice. Double convex lens magnifies or it doubles the object. In flat or plane mirror, we have this type of mirror in our homes. The image is virtual. It means it's not a real. It is the same distance behind the mirror as the object is in front of the mirror. When you see in mirror, so you can see your image in the mirror. And it is same as, as you or the object is the same size as the object is. And the image is also the same size as the object and the 
same distance behind the mirror as the object is in the front of the mirror. If you are close to the mirror, so you can see your image is closer to you. If you are far from a mirror, so you can see your image is far from mirror. So same distance covered by flat mirror. So whenever you see flat mirror, flat mirror can form an image that is virtual. It means it's not real. And the same size. Now read the question again. Which of the following optical instrument provides an upright virtual that is equal to the object? So the magnifier, no, this is magnifier, it's incorrect. Concave mirror, this is concave mirror, convergent lens, microscope, flat mirror. So flat mirror is the best answer. Flat mirror provides an upright virtual image that is equal to the object. Okay. Now, question number six. Which of the following plants produce seeds? We have discussed in the previous uh, question that some plants just like fern, moss, and fungi, uh, they produce seeds. They produce spores. They are not producing seeds. So, read the or listen this information flowering actually we can divide plants into two categories flowering plants and non flowering plants and again non flowering plants can be divided into seeds producing plants or spore producing plants flowering plants grow flowers and use seeds to reproduce or make more plants like them non flowering plants do not grow flowers and use either seeds or spores which are very tiny parts of the plant that can be used to reproduce to grow more plants just like them. And I have shown the picture of these spores as well. So plants such as fern and mosses are called non-flowering plants. It means they are not producing flowers and they produce spores instead of leaf seeds. They produce spores. They are not producing seeds. There is also another group called the fungus. These include mushroom and these also reproduce by spores. Pine trees, you have seen in northern areas when you go there, you can see pine trees reproduce by producing seeds, but they are not flowering plant. Unlike deciduous trees, deciduous trees are flowering plants. Which produce seeds that are surrounded by fruit? Pine seeds are located on a scales of structures called cones. It means they are not producing fruit. They have a particular structure. The, they are known as cones. And seeds are located on these cones. And we, uh, I just want to tell seaweed as well because they have used this plant in the question. Seaweed is a plant but does not produce like most of the plant or land uh, with flower and pollen. Seaweed is more like a fern that produced by means of spores. Just remember this thing, seaweed producing spores, not seed. Some algal species from symbiotic with other organisms, for example, lichen as a symbiotic association between fungus and green algae. They have used the word lichen. Lichen is a combination of fungus and fun, uh, algae and they help with each other. Fungi produces, fungi provide a structure on which algae uh, is producing and algae uh, make food or algae provide food for fungus. So this is a symbiotic relationship or you can say it's a relationship between fungus and algae. So read the question again. Which of the following plants produce seed? A. Fern. B. Moss. C. Pine. D. Seaweeds. And E. Lichen. And I have told all these. Fern, moss, seaweed, lichen. All are spore bearing. Only pine produces seed. So answer C is correct. Okay, now move on next. It's again related with solar system. Which of the following is an artificial satellite? 
Moon, Cometali, Ceres, Vesta, Sputnik 1. I will tell you one by one. Moon. The Moon is Earth only natural satellite. What is Comet? Comet is an icy small solar system body that when passing close to the Sun warms and begin to release gases. A process called outgassing. So Comet is icy small solar system body. Heli. Heli is the only known short period comet comet that is regularly visible to the naked eye from the earth. And what is Cirrus? Cirrus is the largest object in the main asteroid belt between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter. Vesta is one of the largest objects in the asteroid belt. These are not artificial satellite. You can see Sputnik 1 was the first artificial Earth satellite. And they are asking this question, which of the following is an artificial satellite? So, E is the correct answer. Sputnik 1 is an artificial satellite. Okay, got it? We have done seven questions. Now move on question number eight. Which of the following animal does not have a spines? So I would like to tell what our vertebrate or which animal have a spines. A vertebrate is animal with a spinal cord surrounded by cartilage or bones. The word comes from a vertebra, the, the bones that make up the spine. Animal that are not vertebrates are called invertebrates. Vertebrates include, there are five types of vertebrates. Fish, bird, amphibian just like frog, reptiles just like snake, crocodile and mammals just like us or elephant or cow goat or our mammals the internal backbone protects the spinal cord so just which of the following animal does not have a spines boa boa you can see this is actually a snake uh Mistakenly, I have written the name uh, Ibis Bill is a bird and Boa is a snake and Rohu is a fish. Elephant, you know it. So only crab is here that has no spine. This is invertebrate. So D is the correct answer. I have written mistakenly, this is Ibis Bill. This is the bird name and Boa is the snake name. Don't be confused. Okay, now question number nine. Question number nine. It's a little bit calculation is needed and you please do it. The distance between an object and its image is flat mirror is 30 centimeter. I have told you that plane mirror uh, form an image that is exactly the same size. It means the distance between object with the mirror and uh, with image is 30 centimeter so it means the object and mirror the distance 15 centimeter and the uh, mirror with image 15 centimeter you can divide 30 into two parts i am reading again for you the distance between an object and its image is flat mirror is 30 centimeter so object till image is 30 centimeter so this 15 centimeter this 15 centimeter now if the object is moved away from the mirror through distance 10 cm, it means 10 cm plus 10 plus 15, this is 25 cm and you are uh, moving the object from the mirror 25 cm away. Then what will be the distance between the mirror and the object? So I have told you that 10 plus 15 is 25 cm. So find the answer which one is correct 25 centimeter 50 centimeter 15 centimeter 5 centimeter and 40 centimeter so obviously 25 centimeter got it 
Now move on question number 10. I have told you that vertebrates are those animals, they have backbone and they are of five types. Birds, mammals, fish, amphibian and reptiles. And mammals can be found um, in water, on land and um, flying mammals are also available, you can see bat. So in this picture, they are asking which of the following aquatic animal give birth to live young, to live young and feed them with milk. It means they are asking for mammal. Sea turtle is not a mammal, frog is not a mammal, crocodile is a reptile, penguin is a bird. Obviously, dolphin is a correct answer. Okay, so E is the correct answer. Question number 10. Okay, now I will end this uh, video till question number 10. Inshallah, we will meet again in the next video that I will start from question number 11 to 20 or 15. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.